well here we go back again with another video and yes we're here with some more Sunderland news but as you can see I'm out of me running a run today out of me run today I'm absolutely soaking wet it's absolutely pissing down really cats and dogs I'm like a drowned rat but I love a bit of exercise and it's great to get out there you know you can only get wet once once you're wet get home get a shower then you're dry then have a couple of brewskis and bob jungle happy days so before we get into striking news the three away fixtures in america one two at two o'clock starts in the morning one to 12 o'clock midnight start i'm going to try and i say try mine because i don't know if i'll be able to do the the away midnight live stream unfortunately i won't be doing the one at two o'clock in the morning tomorrow or tonight if I can't sleep, then possibly, I don't know, ifs and buts and maybes. But we do have three away games in America. And also, apparently there's news that Lahaji, yes, Lahaji, once away. The young lad once away. There's, oh, allegedly, but he's in America training. Now, whether he wants away or not, or whether somebody just wants to come in for him. Some Qatar team, apparently. The rain is relentless. It is absolutely relentless, this rain. Jesus, bloody hell. Yes, it's non-stop rain and it's absolutely relentless. But it is what it is. Like I said before, I love exercise. I love getting out and about. So Lahaji, rumours are coming out of the club is that he's a bit of a lazy trainer as well. So I don't know if that's true or not. That's just what I've heard. Doesn't put the shift in on the training pitch as much as other players. But everybody's different. He's a young kid. He's only learning. I think if he stayed at Sunderland, he would improve throughout the whole of the season and be an asset to Sunderland Football Club. But these American friendlies, you can buy a live stream, purchase a live stream on the SFC official website for $4.99, $4.99 or a three deal package for $9.99. It's great for the Americans over there watching the Sunderland lads. Not too good for us getting us, getting us up in the middle of midnight. I may have to wait to the end of the sort of, maybe it's the end. I may have to wait to the next day to do a match review and watch the footage, the highlights, possibly for two of them. I might do a live stream for the, the third one if I get out, if I stay up that long. I need some match sticks to keep my eyes open, possibly. Well, the rain's finally easing off. So yes, striking news. I know you've all come for it now. I like to keep my subscribers up to date with any information I get from sources. And apparently the deal is done. The deal is done with Matty Jarfrija and the young 20 year old lad from Croatia. He, he's done, the deal's done A medical will be happening next week. Medical will be happening next week. <laughs> a bit of Spike on there, haven't I? That's it, Buffy the Vampire Slayer. He was called Spike, wasn't he? That's another video I'm doing. I'm doing a video out and about on the Mad Out and About channel. Video will be coming up hopefully some point today or tomorrow. And that's something to do with Buffy the Vampire Slayer and Spike as well. But uh, clearly. But there, Madija, Mad Madija Frisian is, you know, the deal's done. Money's sorted. Everything's organised. Just medicals to go next week. And then happy days will be announced, hopefully at some point, the back end of next week. Brilliant stuff. Also, there's a new sponsorship partnership deal with Hayes Travel. Yes, John Hayes, who founded Hayes Travel. Go on the website, official website, SFC, official website. It tells you all about the new, new sponsorship deal, partnership with Hayes Travel. Happy days. So, Madija Frisian, 20. So, Madija Frisian. Madija Frijan, the 20 year old Croatian, scored 13 goals and 27 appearances for his club in the Croatian League. Apparently, reportedly, reportedly, he was wanted by Rangers as well for about 5 million. So, Sunderland have got the deal done. I'm led to believe, I've been told by my sources, you know, the, the deal is done. We're waiting a medical next week. So, there we go. What's your thoughts on that striker? Are you happy he's coming in? Hopefully, we'll get some more. Who else do you want to come into the club? What's any more strikers? We we'll obviously need a new keeper as well. So it's going to be lots of things happening. Lots of ins, lots of comings, ins happening. Comings, ins happening. Lots of inward bound players happening with strikers. Probably another, like I say, a keeper, possibly two strikers. And who will who will be the first player to leave Sunderland this summer window? Hopefully we'll keep them all. I mean, as much as Lahaji you know, allegedly wants to be away. It's paper talk, isn't it? Allegedly wants to be away. Allegedly a bit lazy in training. He's a young lad, you know, he's got a lot to learn. But he is skillful. He has the skill there from France, this lad. He's potentially absolutely a world beater. And he's wanted by Qatari outfits. So hopefully he'll stay at Sunderland. Hopefully he'll settle better, learn the English language, stay at Sunderland. But I'm hoping 
Like I say, that deal will be done next week for the strike game. We get more deals in and more keepers. One keeper. Right, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe channel. Take care. God bless me. God go with you. And also like the video. And I'll leave a link down below in the description for my other channel, Mads Out and About. I'll be uploading the video to do with lots of things out and about lately. Right, see you later. Thank you. What's me up for you, follow? Don't follow. Let's see if we can find a bit of shelter away from the rain. A bit of shelter. What's this? A bit of shelter? Ah, yes. Ah, oh, bit of a shelter which... Fuck me. It is absolutely pissing down. I'm like a drowned rat. I am like a drowned rat. Just been talking to myself for about 15 minutes in this church and I realised I wasn't even recording. What an absolute idiot. But yeah, there's something about churches that really relaxing, chill you out. I feel all are calm and ease with the world while outside absolutely chucking it down. Not a soul in this church. Nobody at all apart from me. Unbelievable. Today, we all here together to enjoy life. Seven. There's somewhere you'd see Buffy the Vampire Slayer when you're coming down trying to kill off them vampires, those pesky vampires. It's never going to be open in a million years.